Hi, everybody. I'm Senator Rich Funky. We are less than a week away from the state budget deadline, which is April 1st. There are a number of issues still being discussed, including Uber and Lyft for Upstate, affordable college, infrastructure investment, and much more. I'll be sure to keep you in the loop on budget developments in the coming week. The spending that Albany mandates on local governments and school districts is the top reason our property taxes are among the highest in the nation. Incredibly, just a handful of state mandates ate up nearly every property tax dollar collected in New York last year. Last week, the Senate passed a bill of mine that would require the state to cover the cost of any new or growing mandated expense to better protect local schools and quality of life services. Since our common sense solution passed the Senate with strong bipartisan support, I hope the Assembly will also act to protect taxpayers as soon as possible. The Senate also passed a package of legislation last week to better support our agriculture industry, which remains a top grower of jobs and investment in our region. It included a bill of mine to establish our Healthy Options, Healthy Communities program. In neighborhoods across our community, access to healthy, affordable food continues to be a barrier for too many families. Our common sense solution would help more small shops stock fresh produce on their shelves and break up the food deserts that exist in too many places across our state. Together, I think we can feed a healthier, stronger, and more prosperous New York. It's final push time for our Farm to Food Bank program. Last week, I joined a diverse group of lawmakers and farmers, plus anti hunger and environmental advocates, to push the governor to say yes to Farm to Food Bank in this year's budget. We worked hard to include it in the Senate budget proposal passed recently, and in the spirit of March Madness, the ball is now in the governor's court. We hope he joins us to support local farmers and hungry families this year. Our March Business of the Month is Cy Plastics and Honey Oi, a maker of custom plastic components. You can learn more about this growing local business and all of our businesses of the month on my YouTube channel. Just search Senator Funky on YouTube.com. I had a chance to join with bipartisan partners in both houses last week to advocate for investment that would help grow advanced gaming jobs in our community and across upstate. Game development is a fast-growing sector in our region, nowhere more so than an RIT state-of-the-art magic gaming center. We are doing what we can to keep gaming growing in our region. Finally, we recognized World Down Syndrome Day in the Senate last week, and we did it in style thanks to my fellow Senator Kathy Marchione. The Lots of Socks campaign raises awareness for Down syndrome research and care. It's a great cause. Enjoy your week. I'm Senator Rich Funky.